Hello, my name is Rosella Ferrari. I'm a reader in Chinese and theater studies in the Department of East Asian Languages and Cultures, and I teach uh, modules relating to cinema and performance cultures. Um, in Chinese cultures on screen and stage, students learn about key issues and events in the often um, interconnected histories of Chinese film and theatre since the 20th century. So we study the origins of cinema in the so-called opera films based on indigenous theatrical forms. Um, we look at the origins of Chinese modern theatre in Japan. Um, then we look at uh, some examples of silent cinema in the uh, so-called golden age of Shanghai filmmaking. And um, then we move on to uh, studying the politics of uh, socialist uh, cinema and theatre under Mao and during the Cultural Revolution. Uh, and then we look at post-socialist um, practices uh, in film and theatre. For example, um, Chinese uh, new so-called new wave or new Chinese cinemas, independent documentary filmmaking. Uh, we look at women's cinema, commercial cinema, avant-garde performance, and other um, genres and trends. Uh, this course is quite interdisciplinary because we look at the interconnections between film and theatre, but also between film, theatre and other uh, media or disciplinary areas, for example, literature and um, video making or the visual arts. And we also look at questions of adaptation, intermedial and intercultural adaptation. Chinese film and theatre are placed in a global context and we uh, contextualise them with respect to transnational developments. Uh, we look, for example, at uh, historic connections between China and Hollywood, including uh, questions of representations of China and Chineseness uh, in classic Hollywood cinema and also in more recent films. And this also includes questions of self-exoticism and self-orientalism. And uh, moreover, we investigate connections between the uh, cinema and theatres of China and those of the rest of the Chinese-speaking region, for example, Hong Kong, Taiwan, Singapore and other areas. Um, this module is designed for students with knowledge uh, of Chinese at intermediate or advanced level and is one of the main language-based disciplinary options in year uh, three and four of the BA Chinese degrees. So in the seminars, uh, we read a variety of Chinese language texts related to the weekly um, viewings, uh, the weekly screenings. And for example, we can read uh, screenplays, uh, we read uh, scripts, um, we read letters, archival, historical documentation, reviews, uh, pieces of uh, critical essays and other uh, such documents. Uh, there are two contact hours, two contact hours per week, one uh, lecture and one seminar. And uh, in terms of assessment, the first is a choice between a reaction paper, a short film analysis and a video presentation. The second is a quiz and the third is either an essay that uh, shows evidence of views of Chinese language sources or a critical commentary to one of the Chinese language texts that we have read and discussed uh, during the, the, in class, during the, the, the course. Um, this module cannot be taken in conjunction with the non-language based module Cinema and Performance in China, Critical and Historical Approaches because of content overlap. So the two modules share a lecture and have their own separate uh, tutorials, seminars actually. Um, I look forward to meeting you uh, in class.